think Carla can go speak to people. Don't burn yourself. I don't think it's just going to be a random person. Uh, it's, I... it's one of these red people, I'm pretty sure. Do you reckon? Nearby, and the only place nearby from where we Still found her was the grove. That's it. God. What about the mountain pass? That's pretty close by. I don't think so. There was a... There's supposed to be a wizard at the back. Well, I guess he never joined the fight. What a surprise. I mean, the archer didn't really help, did he? Do you want to scroll of enlarge to learn? Yes. Apparently that's useful. Um, yeah, I'm going to quick save it as well. Because um, we've done it. Without any death. Well, kind of. Died, but we're alive. Well, one res is fine. Okay, we're gonna to talk to what's his name? Pelson. Yeah, but I don't see a quest. Oh, there is. Getting all the stuff up top. To stay idle. Oh, he's not very happy. Why well, he's not happy? With Car Kaga? Kaga? Oh, yeah. You deserve to be banished, and she's just run off. Took it upon yourself to undertake the right of thorns. I ought to exile you from this place forever. Instead, I shall listen to the explanation that you owe me. I owe you nothing. Goblins swarmed us like roaches while you stumbled after the past. You chose to abandon us. I chose to protect us. Silence. The right has been ended. I will allow you to stay. But consider yourself a novice anew. You have forgotten the ways of the druids, our place in the natural order. You shall learn it all once again, right here. Backslide, and nature's fury will crush you. As you wish, Master Helsin. Okay. Spilled blood will not write bad blood. Allow me to deal with my own. I still have need of her. You will soon see why. But enough of that for now. I owe you my thanks. The grove stands. Nature prevails. And again, I am in your debt. Speak to Wrath. He will reward you for your efforts. Better be good. I mean, soon. Remember reward. the dangers I told you about. There'll be plenty of time to face them. Take tonight to rest, recuperate, celebrate. Tomorrow, I'll join your camp so oh. I can help with the trials yet to come. Why is this uh, fist glowing? <laughs> <laughs> You saved us. 
I wasn't sure we'd make it through. I wish I had better. But this is all I have. <laughs> You're in the shop again. Oh. Most of Sina. I didn't loot any of the people, so. And that's everything. Uh, What? Oh. What did you get? No, it says like, go into this room and then like, there's no, oh there is. I just didn't see it. You've done it. You brought House in back. Thank you. No, thanks is not enough. May Sylvanus bless you for all your days. I cannot imagine taking on a camp full of goblins was a simple task. Need to go to the goblin village and see what if there's anybody in there, to be honest. <laughs> I'm just here for a reward. It is well earned. Let me show you on your map where you can find the cash. Oh now, my god. Take this rune. You'll need it. Place it among the pedestals inside our library. When the library is brightest. Everything in the vault below will be yours. Let's get trapped. Master House. What? Right. Okay, we're going to give you a reward, but we're not going to give you it. You're going to have to go and find it. A parasite brimming with magic. Oh, I can take the parasite from this drow. Oh, well, instead I could. This one? Did you put the thing in the empty socket? No. I don't have the thing. Oh yeah, I do. The inventory is reversed, so the new stuff's at the top rather than the bottom. It's so annoying. You can change that. Can you? How do you? Yeah, we click the sort by option yeah. and then change it to like type. And it should put the latest stuff at the bottom. Oh, okay. I, okay. Well, type's not too bad. Okay. All right, I'll put it in. Now what? Do we have to push them all? Check of weave instruction? I don't know. 10 XP, great. Secret tunnel! Let's click. Oh, it's a... Soldier. Oh, for God's sake. A glaive? Yeah, it is a 1 to 10. It's got called something, something called Sorrowful Lash. I don't even know who uses it. I don't know if Shadow can use glaives. Let's see. No. Who the fuck uses glaives? Oh, uh, Karlak can use glaives. Okay. Come on, yeah, let's go. 
Hopefully that's a light weapon then. Oh no, that's two-handed. Okay. So five to fourteen. This is five to fourteen. But this has a. Oh, cool. Okay. I can pull a creature towards me. That's useful. Is that it? That's it. There was nothing else here. I got there a couple of notes. spells, but that's it. Like, and they weren't very good ones. Wow. Okay. Well, this is this body over here is what they said. Just take the parasite thing, but I don't know if it just took it automatically. I didn't see it go up because we had four after we killed that uh, goblin leader. Oh, okay. Yeah, the, when you loot it, there's just a letter, I think. Or a note. There's no... Um, should we do a long rest just to get spell slots back? We should. We should indeed. Anybody need to talk? Doesn't look like it. Uh, Will. Will does. And Gale. Oh, of course. Gale needs another bloody weapon. Absorb. God's damn her. Just look at me. I'd be hunting devils and demons, she said. Traitors and hypocrites. Heartless evils of all sorts, but not... I can't not resurrect Zarya's with that guy. Victims. Not innocent tieflings. Warlock pets tend to be unforgiving from what you know of them. Will was lucky he didn't face a more severe punishment. I bear the image of one at least, but my heart is the same. It's Mazora who grants me the power to conjure armor and cast eldritch blasts. Before I was infected, I could even call hell beasts and summon festering clouds, but I promise you, Every thrust of my blade and every flame I sparked was for the good of the coast. What happens if we just don't talk to Gale? Mm, nothing. Just as I'm aware. Oh, I suppose you have to do it enough times to progress his quest, though. Maybe. Mm. He's not even... I don't think I need to speak to him on my side, but let's see what happens if I speak to him. My condition likes being ignored as little as I mm. do. I must consume another artifact. Let's see what we've got here that I can give him. Um, Carlex got some stuff if you want. I don't know what to make of it. Listen, I need to speak to you, to all of you. It would be unconscionable of me to remain silent. Oh. I might just be about to remedy that. You have to know who I was. You have to know who I really am. What I am is a walking shadow of the promise I once held. And what one might call a wizard prodigy. And from an early age could not only control the weave but compose it much like a musician or a poet such was my skill that it earned me the attention of the mother of magic herself the lady of mysteries the goddess mistra she revealed herself to me and she became my teacher in time she became my muse and later even my lover okay Oh, yes. We enjoyed each other's company. Body, mind, and soul. But even so, I desired more. 
You see, no matter how powerful a wizard we mortals can become, we never scratch more than the surface of the weave. Mistra keeps us in check. There are boundaries she doesn't let us cross. Yet, every time I was with her, I stood on the precipice, gazing into the wonders that lay beyond. I sought to cross her boundaries. I tried to convince her. I pouted. I pleaded. I swore my ambition was only to serve her better. She only smiled and told me to be contented. Inconceivable as it seems to me now, I shared a bed with a goddess. And yet I wasn't satisfied. So I sought to prove myself worthy to her instead. We come now to the crux of my folly. Shall I share the story behind it, or would you rather head straight to its sordid finale? Uh... Very well. Here goes. Once upon a very <laughs> long time ago, a mighty lord lived in a tower. A flying tower. To be precise. This almost seems unbelievable. Save his history for another time, but the gist of it is that he sought to usurp the goddess of magic so that he could become a god himself. And he almost managed, but not quite. And his entire empire, Netheril, came crashing down around him as he turned to stone. The magic that was unleashed that day was phenomenal, roiling like the prime chaos that outdates creation. Even the weave itself could not withstand the onslaught. It fractured and shattered, and all magic was lost to the mortal realms. Mm -hmm. Until the day Mistra returned. She restored the weave, reuniting all its scattered shards. Or so I thought. Until, in the course of my studies, I learned of a book. A netherese tome in which a piece of the fracture... What if? I thought... What if, after all this time, I could return this lost part of herself to the goddess? Is this the book that you have? I don't think so, but it could be. The no, it can't be. Try. That's about summoning blooming undead. Fail. I was certain that this deed of raw power, draped in romance, would convince Mistra to take me by the hand and welcome me into her hitherto forbidden domains. I was mistaken. I obtained the fabled book and took it into my study. As for what happened next... Here. Place your hand over my heart. Let me show you. You feel the tadpole quiver. As you realize Gale is letting you in, into the dark. You see through Gale's eyes, staring down the corridors of a draped man. Well, it suddenly opened. Inside there are no creatures, only a swirling mass of blackest weave pounces. Its teeth, its claws. It's unstoppable as it digs through and becomes part of you. And gods, is it ever hungry. Uh. Thankfully, the moment I absorbed the fragment wasn't enough to kill me outright. It was only the beginning. This netherese blight, this orb, for lack of a better word, is balled up inside my chest. And it needs to be fed. As long as I absorb traces of the weave from potent enough sources, it remains quiet. Were it ever to fully destabilize, however. It will die, worse, actually. Oh. I will erupt. I don't know the exact magnitude of the eruption, but given my studies of Netherese magic, I'd say even a fragment as small as the one I carry, it would level a city the size of Waterdeep. We don't know how big that city is, so. 
<laughs> that is true. My chance upon a king's collection of magical we make one house on its own. Corner, we might cross paths with a miracle round the bend. Then again, we might not. All of this. It must feel like a betrayal. Say the word, and we'll part ways. That is a great relief. Maybe we'll get a good reward for you. You truly are a soul that steals my own. Yeah, but... From all my new rallied heart, I thank you. I thank you all. But nothing to... I understand... Well, how are we going to do that, is the question. I'm humbled if you stand with me. This might be part of his question. I will do my best not to let you down. I stand at a precipice. But if you do not give up hope, neither shall I. I'll fight. I'll resist as long as I can. Now, even I am tired of the sound of my own voice. Let us venture forth. Sick. Companion quests. Gail's condition is no longer responding to treatment. We need to keep traveling and find another way to stabilize the orb. Okay, so guess possibly in Act 2. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I'm looking at completed quests. Yeah. Keep traveling. Yeah, it might be Act 2. It might be in the Underdark or it might be in the mountains. We're just transitioning to Act 2, isn't it? Um. We all ready to rest then, I guess? Yeah. Get the spell slots back. Well, I can speak to Ash. Oh, is Volo still here? But there's so many people here. Oh yeah, because the village is here. You know, I never pictured myself as a hero. Never thought I'd be the one they toast for saving so many lives. And now that I'm here. We killed some goblins to save some tieflings. The tally of lives didn't change much. But what do I get for all my hard work? A pat on the head and vinegar for wine. Pfft. You can see his bite mark in his neck. Can't see it. Not this side, other side. Wait till he talks uh, again. Uh... The goblins would have thrown a wider party. No, they wouldn't. <laughs> It's a heavy, rich red, dry and sharp. See what I mean? Oh, oh yeah, I see. It. It's pretty cool. Attention to detail. Fun. Is that so much to ask? By the hells, sex, my dear, a night of passion. And not with you. Just <laughs> I mean, can you imagine? <laughs> Ugh, no. Rude, mate. Anyway, <laughs> You're like a freaking dragon. I'm sure you have someone else to sniff around. Who else is? House then. Speak to him. Go on now. Don't waste a night like this talking to me. We'll have plenty of time together. Leave time together on the way to moonrise. Um. Okay. Later, perhaps. Don't worry about me. <sighs> a night under the stars amidst nature's creation is just what I need after being locked up in the goblin's dungeon. Go on, Looking enjoy druids. yourself. Seek out some wine before it runs dry. There are a lot of thirsty people around here. Well, no one invited him to our camp, so... Well... <laughs> we can speak to Zevlo. Yeah. You have no idea how good it feels to see these people smiling. The singing he looks a bit damaged, doesn't he? Do without, but even so. It's a bit bloody, but wait, that was it. Great, great combo. Okay. I think that's everyone. Is Withers still it? He is. <laughs> Have a drink with Withers. He's got Any one evil? health. <laughs> Oh, what? Where is he? 
do a quick save. <laughs> ah, yes, well struck. Okay, I'll kill him. God, look at his stars. Okay, yes, stats. All ten except wisdom. At least uh, you don't need to worry about reloading that. No, that's big. <laughs> All right. Just talk to Zevlo, but. Why? Because he's green on the map. Oh, oh no, no, because it's, he's. It's the quest tab. You have no idea how good it feels. The I already spoke to him, but. Hmm. Can't do anything. So we just sleep. Yeah. Maybe I guess we can't so. speak to him here. Maybe. Cheese on bread? Cheese on baguette. Cheese on baguette, okay. <laughs> okay. Well, the quest is just completed and he's disappeared, so... I guess that's fine. Okay, we need to talk to House in, but um, save the first period is done. Save the re refugees is done. Oh. Okay. Ooh, shadow beings. There is a terrible curse surrounding oh, I didn't the see he towers. A shadow curse. That drains away all light and life. Few can resist it without dying or transforming yeah, into know. shadow beings. You can try to journey overland if you wish, but I strongly advise you go under. There is a tunnel leading from the Temple of Saluna right oh, no. down into the Why do, they, do people beyond. suggest we go under? I kind of want to go above. Somewhere in the ruins. All right. I would like to join your camp, if you'll allow me. I can offer my skills, my counsel. I've chosen a successor as first druid, Francesca of the High Forest. A bird's already been dispatched to summon her. Precisely. Who indeed? You do not know, and neither do any of the others. The Grove needs to move beyond the mistakes of the past. What it needs is an unknown quantity. An outsider who can enforce the Oak Father's teachings without bias. This is why I chose Francesca. She will restore simplicity and purity to the grove in my absence. Indeed, we quite the journey ahead of. Cool. Okay. We we'll save again. Oh, Scratch is here. Oh, you made his way. Let's talk to him. Oh, you oh. should have done this, not me. Um. Yeah. Hold on. Let me. Maybe to do make friend, hang on. I don't think he needs to, because he's here. He's already oh, friend. He oh, said okay. friend, so. Oh, okay. Pet him. Talk to him. I'm talking to him, but I can. I have the option to ask him, how's his master? What happened to his master or pet him? Yeah, I pet it. I had the option of pet him. Master. Friend. I stayed with him until... Until I knew he was gone. I'll never forget him. But I'm glad to have met you. Well. Well, there you go. I guess that's it. <laughs> Can't take him as a companion then. Doesn't seem like it.